Hi, everybody. Um, I thought as we are now doing a lot of digital downloads, I would show you how you extract the file. So when you get the file, it's zipped. So I thought I'd show you how you unzip it for those of you that are like me and technically challenged. But I do know how to do this bit, I think. So let's have a look, shall we, at this computer screen. So if we, when you receive your email like that, Click on that, it says your order is now complete, which is fabulous. We like it when an order is complete. So then if you go to your product, so that's telling you what you've bought, and then this is your download. So if you click on that, that will open up your order. And you can see at the top here, it's downloading or it's, it's bringing up the file that you need to unzip. So if you click on that, that will open that up, select it, and then right click and it should give you an option to open. If you then select all of them, so just go down and select all of those files and then go up to the top and go to extract and extract all. It will then ask you to find a location to save that to. So if you go to browse, that will open up your computer and I like to save mine in, onto a USB so I can still use my scan and cut without having to have a computer open. So if I click USB, go to select that folder and then extract, it will then put all those files, open them all up for you so that you can use them. And then once it's finished, we're going to show you how to uh, put the USB into your scan and cut, which is super simple. So it might look slightly different depending on what operating system you're using, but somewhere along the line you will find extract all, etc. So it's just going to take its time and do what it needs to do because it's got a lot of files to download, which is great because it means you're getting lots of value for money. And it will always give you that percentage complete notice. So you can always go off and make a cup of tea if you want to. So we'll wait for this to be done. And then it really is a case of just right clicking on your USB and asking it to eject it, which I sometimes do and sometimes I just pull it out of the machine. But you should <laughs> eject it properly. Sometimes I do. Occasionally, maybe. <laughs> I am really bad for that though, because I'm impatient, that's what it is. Right, we're getting there now. It's very exciting and I love the fact that we're doing downloads now because A, there's no postage on them and B, it's instant. So within minutes of you checking out and paying for your order, you've got your download and you're good to craft, which is what we want. Right, let's see what's going on here. Um, just while we're doing this, please join us. If you haven't been watching our live shopping events recently at Highlight Crafts, we will be bringing more and more hours to you over the weeks and some special guests that we're in the middle of sourcing out for you. So make sure that you tune in on uh, Facebook, Instagram, and our website, which is great. Right, so now all I'm gonna do is go over to the USB and right click. Try again, let's right click. There we go. And here it says eject, and we're just gonna eject. And then as soon as this sign comes in, save to remove hardware, we can then remove it from the computer and we can pop it into our scan and cut. So at the side of here, at the side of the screen, there is a USB port. Just pop it into there like so. Allow it to load and the USB will flash when it's loading. And then once it's um, loaded, it will just become a, a, a light. And then all you're gonna do is take your stylus and go to retrieve data from the USB. And there are all your cutting files. And it's that simple. Okay? Lovely. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to tune in to our live shopping events. And I will see you very soon. Take care. Lots of love. Bye. If you want to see more from Highlight Crafts, make sure you click the like button. Subscribe by clicking the subscribe button below. And click the bell icon to receive notifications of all our future content. You can also click here to see our latest video. Or click here to see more videos like this one.